Hey, 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 all you beautiful beer drinkers, how are you doing out there? It's Hers Quasar. We're doing something a little bit different today. We're going to do Brew Pub Simulator. I know, it's another simulator, right? But it's beer, man. It's beer. So what's wrong with that, right? Uh, I figured I would try to give this a shot. I've been trying to play this for probably the past three or four nights, and... Honestly, um, it's it's got some glitches. This is a play. This is a play test. So it's got some glitches in it. I think I can find my way around it pretty good. I'm hoping so anyway. So as we're going through it, if you see the glitches that I see, it's just all part of the game. And hopefully, I can get through most of it. And to give you at least a good quality video of what the game is going to be about. And while I talk to you guys, I am enjoying a Christmas ale from the Great Lakes Brewing Company. Yes. Always a good choice. If you're in Michigan or Ohio, pick up a six-pack of Great Lakes Brewing Company Christmas ale. You will not regret it. All right, so we get these little things here. Did you know the first beer crafters were Egyptian women? You always get these little... These little facts that show up down there. It's actually really, really cool. Um, they come across all the time, and I I like it. I mean, I'm not a beer aficionado per se, but I do like craft beers. I'm not a, you know, I'm not a Miller Lite or a Budweiser, Heineken, Corona kind of guy, right? I'm a craft type beer guy. All right, so here we are. Here's my shop. It's got pumpkins all over it, and I think this play test was out in October. I may have missed it. I don't know. Um, I just happened to see uh, Nima last do it, and um, or no, Crimson. I saw Crimson do it. A big shout out to Crimson out there. Um, I'll put her link down below as well. Um, so I saw her playing it, and I was like, oh, okay, this would be pretty cool. So I'm gonna give it a shot. Here we go. We got a lawyer. Here you are at last. Let's not delay any longer. Would you mind spelling your name? I need to put it on the paperwork for Sure. First Quasar. Q U A Y Z A R. Accept that? Yes. All right. Thank you. Excellent. Mr. Quasar, your grandfather decided that the bar will be passed on to a family member who is able to meet all his requirements. As far as I'm concerned, you are the only one eligible. Hmm. Which really tells me at this point there's other people out there. And I may run into a little bit of problems, so we're gonna have to figure that out. Um and tell me, are you ready for the grand reopening? Yes. Yes, I am. Of course you are not ready. Let's look around, it's a mess. Uh, first of all, clean it up. So icky. Alright, so I figured out some of the controls on this as well. I was kind of Goofy on us. Right, can I move this around just a little bit closer? There we go. So yeah, so like the chairs, I can like hit the control button and rotate the mouse around. That's how that works. Um, I did not know that before. Uh, I am <laughs> just trying to figure it out myself. There, both those are done. there uh, we'll put it right there okay so we got it a little somewhat organized one day you will redecorate this place but for now just get rid of the broken stuff okay so all this stuff we're gonna sell off 999 27 bucks ah that's all I got did I get a package? What package? Okay, go to the exit. Uh, back exit, big, big cardboard box. Go. Place is uh, crashed out back here. My kitchen. I forgot to take a look at the kitchen here. Actually, pretty cool. Pretty cool. I was in London and did a, you know, pubs there from 3 to 5 o'clock. You can't get into. Um, just crazy. Alright, I'm gonna go to the kitchen, have all your ingredients to brew. Uh, it's a simple recipe I'm sending to you right now. Good luck with your first beer. Thanks. We'll continue tomorrow. Okay, so uh, we've got that. 
We need to unpack our items here. So, you know, got some cascade hops. Jokey. And we'll put this over here on the stove. Right? Okay. Open up tea for the tablet. This is where my recipes down here. We'll pin that bad boy right to the side. All right. Um. So we look to the side here, uh, add water, add some malt, boil it, eight grams, four grams, and then the and some yeast. All right, so, okay, 5.30, ah, oh. okay, got that. All right, so we need 1.30, Kilograms of the light malt, right? The light malt. Gotta tilt this bad boy. There you go. Uh, one point. Okay, so the, the information is telling me. Up there tells me 1300 milliliters. And that tells. Then the. Recipe tells me 1.30 kilograms. So we are going to go. We'll go 1.3. Okay. Put that on there. Turn the stove. Woohoo. And we're heating it up. All right. Look at that. Temperature's coming up on this bad boy like you cannot believe. Hmm. Smell the beer. Okay, we've got a hundred degrees. Uh, we get to grab a bag, bag of hops and give it eight grams, right? The hops, right? Yeah, that's the hops. All right, so uh, we need eight grams. So up above there in the QED, I've got five grams. Then we go one, two, three. Okay. So after boiling for 40 minutes, uh, we have to add another four grams. Okay, so we're gonna add another four grams. One, two, four. So we got that, and okay, turn off the stove and add. Okay, so I'm gonna just turn that off, add more hops. Okay, so I add four more hops. It's gonna cool down. We're boiling for another 20 minutes. Turn off the stove and add four grams of hop. Add hop aroma. Okay, when it turns to 21 degrees Celsius, I guess that's what it is now. Put yeast in. And what do we need here? We need five grams. So we'll just do a quick five grams. grams we pick this bad boy up go to the fermenting bucket look at that look at the color on that I'm liking it go ahead and put the bucket bag and back over here lid on that bad boy <laughs> we've done our first beer like five days later. okay so we have to wait for it to ferment it. Um, well, I only got four stars out of that. 6.5. That's kind of sucks. Well, I guess I didn't do that as well as I thought I did. Okay. So we're going to go um, HQ, Ale, Ale, Light. Oh, can't go all the way. Okay. Um, 
um, just to go HQ pale ale. We want to jack the price up on us. We we're going to, we worked hard back there. Go. Nope. <laughs> you to unpin it. Morning, Mr. Quasar. Where? Had a glimpse of your bar on my way into work this morning. Not bad, not bad at all. Hope that the beer will match the decor's quality. A friend of mine will visit you today. Are you ready for your first client? Of course I am. No, you are not. This guy, he thinks he knows everything, right? Uh, did you put the beer in your kegs or do you plan to serve it straight out of the pot? Hard ass. Um, actually, what I wanted to do is take a look outside. Look at this guy. Look at this building. This is like awesome, right? This is actually pretty cool. I really like it. Um, how far I can go across the street? I can go all the way across the street. So, actually pretty cool. I can shop here. All right. Um, pick up the keg and drop it in the highlighted area. So, keg, drop it in the highlighted area, pick up the... Okay, so one thing I did learn, the bucket needs to be higher than the keg. So what I do is I put it over here, and then I grab, when I grab one of these connection pipes, I grab it from the bucket to the kegger. So it does do the transfer, right? Then you can disconnect it. You take the bucket, put it back over here says it's clean we can take the lid back off and let air out all right we have a keg remember to connect the keg to the shank so we have to connect um, look at the beer keg and connect it to the shank all right now I can add the pale ale to the menu HQ pale ale right here yeah all right 50. Ooh, ooh. We got a new recipe, the American Black Egg. That might be interesting. We might have to do that next. Okay, you need to order some glasses and you're ready to go. So we'll go open up our tablet. I add these. Order those. Um, inventory. And we place these bad boys right there. All right. I'm ready to open the doors. Yes. Time you are ready. So let's go ahead, smile and be nice to your customers. Your expectations won't be too high right now. You are just at the beginning of your entrepreneur after all. You are absolutely right. Good luck. All right, we are open for business. My business is open for business. All right, somebody's gonna come in. So we are going to grab a glass down right there and these are five milliliter glasses so we have to go as as high as I can without spilling it All right and this is can get really tricky I even have a washer back there. Okay, 490. I'm doing pretty good. Got 490. Got 10 milliliters. I'm, I'm like keeping, keeping it pretty good. Here we go, young lady. You have a nice day. Now, got the glasses here. Gotta wash them. right there for right now these guys are gonna start coming in here like crazy like gangbusters oh, see I've got uh, got a customer right here okay got like the beer 
He looked a little young, but okay. I've had nothing but women come in here. Oof. What is up with all the women? Had nothing but women come in here. That's interesting. Got a bunch of women beer drinkers in here. God bless you. Am I clean? I'm going to keep doing this. glass was clean before I went to go pouring. I've made that mistake before. And it really glitches the game out. So if you try to pour a dirty glass, a beer with dirty glasses, you don't want to do that. I'm gonna make sure the glass is sitting there flush. I don't want to spill any of the beer. I want to be a messy bartender. You know what I mean? All right, made 68 bucks. My first keg of beer. That's pretty good. There you go. I kind of cockeyed in there. If I'm missing some glasses, I feel like I'm missing some glasses here. Okay. Yep, I acted like. That barks, you cleared up the space and you know how to brew. You handle customers great. I'm just going to take my time with this and maybe it won't glitch out on me. Well, she seemed happy, but man, she has a sourpuss on her face. It's almost like a cafe, a cafe simulator I've been playing with beer. Come on, beer is cool, right? Alright, you cleared up a space, you know how to brew, you handle the customers great. Move to the next of your grandfather's wishes. Okay. Um, restore the former glory of its pub. Alright. How do I do that? Oh man, I am out. I am out of beer. Oh. All right, so I'm going to have to... Oh, sorry, boys and girls, but... Okay, I'm going to have to close down shop. All right. I had to close down shop. I have no more beer, so let's go ahead and get... Get everything kind of cleaned up here. Got this glasses. Some of these glasses get really glitchy with the graphics. So you gotta be kind of careful with them, I guess. Okay, let's clean this up. See how it does, does that? Take this. Right there. I don't want to mess with them too much. Yeah, 
I see it's just all kind of glitching out on me already. Okay, so let's try to set it down. Dirty. There we go. So it's just a way to... Glasses are like really crazy. Nothing is working out right. All right, do I have any glasses out here? No. All right, let's move the next further. Uh, he said, of course, your grandpa sold part of his pub. He kept doing it until he was left with what you see right now. He managed to contract the current owners of the part neighboring. They are willing to sell. Get thirty dollars now. We'll move the paperwork. Okay. Good luck, and call me whenever you need it. Okay. So we've collected the 30 bucks. We're going to the tablet here. And we want to do the expansion thing. It's going to cost me 30 bucks to do the upgrade. And they're going to knock out the wall. Look at that. Nice. All right. Got right, confirmation from your bank. Everything is set. I have hired a ninja multitaskers to, to remove the wall, separating two sides of the building. They are extraordinarily skillful. I highly recommend them. Yeah, see for myself. Yeah, I see. Um, it should be done. How do you like your new space? I think it's so spacious. Indeed, do you know how to use a shopping app? Of course I do. Around for some entertainment. You don't want this pub to be just a drink and eat. Okay, so we're going to go in here. Uh, there's mini games. Uh, buy an arcade game. How's that? So in my inventory, I've got an arcade game. If I hit, oh, okay. I put this, out. oh, I can't put it right up against that wall. That kind of sucks. All right. <laughs> uh, we were playing for hours. In fact, we forgot to open a bar that day. More fun activities will affect the duration of your customers' visits. Keep them entertained and money will flow. Oh, I can play the game. Hang on. Look at that. Here's Quasar. Alright, new game. I just gotta jump over the green piles of crap. Going for it. Look at that. This is like doodle jump or something. I don't know. I've got skills, boy. Ah, oh. yeah, that was kind of a tough one right there. Look at that, eighteen sixteen. <laughs> Oh, wow. All right, cool. All right, uh, speaking of money, okay. Um, you, if you think seriously about this business growth, we shall discuss making adjustments in the brewing section, okay? Uh, you will need more space for the ingredients and utensils. We have, a, we have to prepare for another expansion, okay. Whenever you will be ready, collect $50, and I will contact Ninja Multitaskers once again. All right, I've got to collect 50 bucks. Um, I have nothing right now. So let's um, connect you. Okay, I, could, I guess that, that's empty, right? Okay, so let's make ourselves up another batch of the pale ale. Um, actually, let's tab recipe. Oh, we have the new one, the black ale act. Try that one. Um, why don't we try that one? So let's pin that recipe. Water, light malt extract, American chocolate malt. Mm, All right, so 530. Okay, same as the last time. Okay, so that was a little. A little much. 
right. Um, light malt extract. Um, I don't think I have much of that, so let's. I need magnum hops. So let's go here. Hop supplies. Get light malt extract. Hops. I needed the magnum hops. I needed the American chocolate. Order that. Go ahead and get there for right now. Uh, magnum hops. We'll put that right there for now. Ooh, look at that. Oh, wait a minute. Okay. So we've got that. All right. So let's grab this. Uh, we need. How we do? Add 1.1 kilograms of light malt extract. Light malt extract. Okay, so I didn't have much there. Okay, so that's no thing. Let's. Okay, I can throw. Haha! <laughs> throw that away. Put it in the neighbors. Okay, so let's uh, grab the neighbor. Oh, get the alt extract here. Um, oops, just kind of spilled stuff everywhere. Uh, we needed 1.1. Uh, close enough. Light malt extract. Add 23 grams of American chocolate malt. So, 63 grams, huh? There's 50 grams. Sixty. One. Two. Three. Right. And now what? Okay. Boil it. Get up to a hundred degrees. Then uh, seven grams of the magnum hops. So seven grams of those. Okay. Seven grams and then boil for sixty minutes. All right. Need American yeast at this point too. So this is smelling good. Chocolatey. Right, I've got to wait for 60 minutes, right? 60 minutes, right. So while I'm waiting here, I'm going to enjoy my Christmas sale. I will say this is something I've never done. I've never tried to do my own beer. This seems like a whole lot of work for just so little. I'll just go to the store and buy a six pack, right? But there is something about making your own beer. Okay, so we've got that. Um, well, for 60 minutes, wait till the mixture cools down. Okay, so we'll turn that off. Uh, add five grams of American yeast. Okay. Yeast. Oh, why is it in there? Cooled off. Okay, the American yeast. I need. Um, what did I need? Five grams. All right. All right. Transfer the bucket. Transfer this to the bucket. All right. Ah, I can smell the chocolatey version of it right now. Okay, then lit it. Oof, okay. So one day left. All right, so that's got the ferment. I've got 10 bucks left. 
Um, let that ferment right now. What we'll do is we'll set it over there. Hopefully, ferment done. Unpin that. So we've got everything I think we need. How many glasses do we have? We have one, two, three, four, five, six. I didn't lose any glasses. How about that? Um, should I rearrange this place? We can't move the stools. Oh, the stools are fine. fine. Actually, let's move this one bar stool in here. I want to move both of them over there. One there. The guy's on the end. That's what I want. And, uh... Right. Any ferment yet? No, nope. doesn't say. It says it started. Okay. Alright, so I'll just let it be. I got four of six chairs. What is over here? Oh, hey, look at this. Got myself an outdoor space. Nice. Oh, oh, what's this? Oh, oh. This is going to be nice. This is actually going to be nice. This is going to be a nice outdoor bar area. This is going to be really cool. Like in that. Okay. Actually, I'm waiting for this thing to ferment. Um, I don't have any money to buy anything else. Bought all my ingredients to do this. So, I did say the fermentation was started, so I'm just waiting. I mean, I could try and do the other batch. I need to. I don't know how much is left in there. 1.24. I don't even need another bucket. Which is a bucket? Three box. Um... Okay, we're gonna, we'll try that. We'll try it with another one. This doesn't seem to be working. Doesn't seem to be wanting to do what I think it should be doing. All right, so let's go back to the tab. Let's go here, do the American Pale Ale, pin that up. Okay, 530 water. I don't have enough malt extract. Yikes. Well. Uh, yeah, that's gonna be that's gonna be a thing. Throw that away. Hey, did you stick over there? Let's see if I can if this will probably not so let's um i don't have enough for the malt extract that's the problem okay so we will try to do it with this um i guess we'll try it like this not enough malt extract done so it might be a little weak grab the cascade hops Give her five grams. Got eight grams. Put this up here. I'm gonna need to just uh, let it boil for 40 minutes. 
or more. Alright, so I'm gonna have two minutes. Okay. Add four more. Let it boil for 20 minutes. Hopefully this will, I got like the black ale, not, doesn't look like it's fermenting. So let's pick that bad boy up, let's stick it over there. Oh. You are done, so let's get the yeast, and I need 5 grams of yeast. So I've got 16, yep, 5. A light uh, extract is an out. Okay. Right, we'll give it a give her a go, I guess. Right now, I've got two tubs. This is gonna be a weak batch, I. Right. got the dark and the light and um, I don't know what I'm supposed to do if I open the bar let's see if I open it and then close it Customization. Hang on. Okay, so it's an inner. The HQ. Ale Ale. So I had to open and close the shop down, I guess. Grab that. Transfer to the keg. Got a nice transfer. Now transfer from the keg to the shank. Yeah. Let's get this bucket out. Open her up. There we go. This is American Pale Ale. So I don't know what to deal. All right, let's, uh, we will start business. Open up. So far it's been lasting okay for me. Let's unpin that and I'm gonna collect 50 bucks. Hey, hey, how you doing? Uh, just give me any beer, huh? Okay. All right, you got it, bro. Is it not? Hmm. Okay, so right there. Should have. Should have beer. I am not having any beer. Um. Let me close up for a second. Let me close.
close up. I've got a problem here, ladies and gentlemen. I have an issue I'm trying to figure out. I should have. I've got all everything connected. I hate that. Okay. So why are you not? Okay. Oh, that's why. I have to put it up there. Okay. Thought it was already up there, so I was like, okay. Alright, so now we should be back in business here. And advertise, 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 advertise. Okay, let's uh, see if I can do this. All right, I think we're back in business here. I think the glass is leaking a little bit. Take care. Thank you very much, sir. Where did my glass go? Is my glasses are a little wonky. Go. Enjoy the beer, sir. Oh, wait a minute. No, you're right there. There we go. Somebody's passes. Ah, uh, the hell. My glasses are disappearing. People are taking my my ear glasses. That's not cool. That's just not cool. Can I see you in here uh, yesterday? Not so. A little young to be in here, young lady. Showing me how much you had. Uh, there we go. Alright, let me, uh. Glasses are disappearing. Glasses here, so I gotta come out here. We got only got one glass out here. What the hell? We're running off with my glasses. Oh, spilled a little bit on the bar. All right.
go. How much do I have left in the Defense Brewery? Purchase the upgrade via the tablet. Okay. Well, I'm going to keep selling beer until I am tapped out. We got a few left, so... Keep up with the glasses. I think I'm going to. Do, I think I'm doing all right. I'm doing a lot better than I have been in the past five or six times I've tried this. Got it, bro. I think their movements are actually pretty good. Got a minute 39 before closing. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep serving beer until closing. My grandpa would be so proud. I have a 144 milliliters left. That is not even enough to do anything. But we are going to close up shop. Oof. All right. Got only a couple of glasses left. Got two glasses left. Hey, that was not nice. Okay, grab that. This up. Now, I would I, I would love to be able to have this, be able to save this, but I can't save it right now. This will not allow you to save. So, got the glasses clean. So the tablet. Uh, we're going to do the expansion. Uh, level 2. Upgrade. Alright. Yeah. Look at this, baby. We knocked out that whole backside. Alright. Look at this. We've got all the space in the world. Uh, collect enough money to... Buy the kitchen. Buy the kitchen? Hmm. Alright, we don't have enough there. Um, I can make some more or just use that. Which uh, I think I probably need a new cake for. Uh... Egg. Oh, it's only five bucks. Cool. All right. Um, let's uh, disconnect that. That's HQ Pale Ale. We'll put this up here. Uh, this over here. Chocolatey version. All right. Get this out of here. There. That. Gotcha. Now, if I go out here, up on the menu, um, I want to edit. This is uh, HQ Dark Age. Uh, go for the 550 again. Confirm. And there we go. Close that up. 
I need more glasses. Uh, get another box of these glasses. All right, we're good to go. Now I can expand the kitchen. Expand the kitchen. Buy the kitchen. Okay, well, we'll do that then. Alright, I think we are ready to open. Serve up beer all day long. That's my, that's my job right now. Ah, oh, it's not full enough for you. this out. Okay, it was only 20. Okay, I can't give you it more. There we go. Everybody loves my beer. Everybody loves it. You want a beer? I can see you down here, bro. There you go. Alright. I think she was giving me the eyes. for the next customer. All right. Start and leave. Pipe is... Don't believe the hype, they say. Gotcha. Yeah. Go play the games, bro. Play the games. I don't know if I get any kickbacks from that or not. I have no idea. Keep, we keep serving up beers all day long. How you going, bro? There you go. There you go. Good to go? Alright, cool. As I go through these glasses like you would not believe, man. How you doing, bro? How's life treating you? You see you come in. Thanks for uh, stopping by. Right. Back again, young lady. I think you've been here the past uh, couple of days. Try some of that chocolatey dark ale of mine. Beautiful thing. Okay, that 
there. Try to get these glasses clean. Quickly as possible. Alright. Ooh, where'd it go? Hey, okay, bro. Right one right there. Bold one. Hey, didn't I see you just in here not too long ago? There you go. Alright. How much beer do I have left? I've got... 386 milliliters is not enough for another beer. So what I sure. you guys are not gonna be here. I'm gonna try and pull it off. Oh. I am out. <laughs> yep. I know. I know. So we're gonna close up shop here. Right. Expenses of 63, total income $20. Uh, I cannot not make enough money on that one, that's for sure. Okay. Um, clean up shop here before I go do the expansion thing. Okay. up and then we'll take a look and see what this expansion is all about. I thought this was going to be the only expansion. See the chip, see the, my, my mug went straight through the table. Sorted out. Put the table put it back where it belongs. Alright. Um, kitchen expansion. Huh? Alright. Go with a T. Expansion. Kitchen upgrade. Alright. Upgrade. Bucks. Ah, kitchen upgrade. I get it. Okay. So what that is, is this is the kitchen, right? I think this is what I'm saying. One over here. This is... How do I get to the kitchen? I think it's the kitchen's in there somehow. I think that's probably hire the cook via the tablet. Hire the cook. People. Uh, 50 bucks cook. Hire. Okay. Hired him. All right. So I have hired the cook. Um, all right. So thanks for playing the playtest version of Brew Pub Simulator. We should list the game. Out a short survey, you can continue playing or exit the main menu. Um, I can continue, but I'm not gonna, I don't think I'm going to. I mean, I've got 63 bucks, I don't know where my, my cook went. I mean, I hired the guy and he's nowhere to be found. <laughs> All right, is he out? Are you, you're not my cook. Where, where'd he go? All right, hey. Thanks for hanging out with me. I appreciate it. Now you can see what we have as far as the brew pub simulator. So this is going to be a really nice area out here to put up, set up tables, and probably some entertainment and stuff. This will be really cool. So, um, yeah, until the next time, ladies and gentlemen, thanks again for hanging with me. Uh, let me know what you think of the game. Uh, okay, I'll put it on my wish list, and maybe you can too. So, in the meantime, this is Hurst Quasar saying good night, everyone. Um, I'm out.